In terms of Sephardic Heritage Museum's involvement with creating grave sites and cemeteries for the future, God forbid, needs of our community, all began with the cemetery in Staten Island. We, the Sephardic Heritage community, was given one board seat to represent our community in the oversight of the cemetery that I asked Rabbi Sultan to lead for us, which he had. And from that experience, we realized that we were underserved for the future, not just underserved as a community here, which God bless them, the Sultan family has now spearheaded our move to New Jersey, but the need for our community to have a place of rest in Israel proper. So we went out on a mission, as Sephardic Heritage does with its new challenges for our community, to find the perfect location on Harazitim. And through a complicated search, find, negotiation with the church, we were able to find a wonderful plot with great views that could be a future home for generations after 120 years old. And so began the next Sephardic Heritage Museum venture to create a cemetery for our community on Harazitim in Israel. We're standing in front of the section for the Syrian community on Har Zetim. This is the first time the community has a specific section meant for them, 600 spots. What's important to notice here is the view of the Temple Mount. You're able to see the area of the Kodesh HaKodashim. So this area has a tremendous significance because it's the mountain of Hazetim where you have the greatest sages, Kohanim, and prophets of the Jewish history. Within a hundred feet of our section is the graves of Haggai and Malachi. You see the roof, the red roof over there on top of the building. So this section is called Halkat HaNevi'im, the section of the prophets. Navi says that the Hayat HaMetim begins in Hazetim. That's where it starts and then spreads to the rest of the world. You know, after 120, this is, the, is, this is the best real estate. This is an opportunity for our community to be able to have a spot, part of the section of 600 of our community members facing the old city of Jerusalem and a zechut for somebody to grab a spot on Har Zetim. It's a segula le'orech uh, yamim. If those that can long-term secure a spot on Har Zetim for the uh, for the moment of Tehiyat Metim for resurrection, uh, I don't think anybody will ever regret that. It's the best piece of real estate you can buy. The opportunity here is enormous. And Be'ezat Hashem, we should all take the opportunity and take whatever we can for us and for our loved ones and our family.